Once you've made the commitment to sell your home, chosen a realtor to represent you, and established a list price, it's time to work with your realtor to market your property so it sells as quickly as possible. There are many things you should expect of your realtor and there are several things that your realtor should discuss with you as well. Over the next couple minutes, I will outline what an exceptional marketing plan looks like as well as what you should expect from your realtor and what your realtor will expect from you. The more you know about the process of selling your home, the easier it is to support your realtor's efforts. The day your home goes on the market, it should be in pristine condition and priced right to attract the most potential buyers. While your realtor can help you determine an appropriate price and can offer suggestions to make your home more appealing, your job is to put in the work to make your home look pristine and to remove clutter and personalization. Buyers want to see a home where they can see themselves living. If buyers see an overstuffed closet, they'll assume the home lacks storage space. And if your kitchen counters are cluttered, they'll think the space is too small. Provide your realtor with tips about what you love best about your home and community that can be incorporated into your marketing materials. Your realtor can advise you on what you need to repair before putting your home on the market. I also recommend my clients visit other homes that are for sale or even local model homes for ideas on ways to present your home to potential buyers. Many realtors have experienced staging homes or they can bring in a stager to rearrange your home. In addition, your realtor should market your home in multiple ways. For example, I've developed a marketing plan that sets itself apart from many other real estate professionals. This includes Matterport virtual reality tours, professional photographs, magazine advertising in 5280 Magazine, custom property websites with unique URLs, professional TV advertising, targeted direct mail and property brochures, social media campaigns, and much more. Once buyers begin visiting your home or contacting your realtor, your agent should respond as quickly as possible to keep the momentum going. Every visitor to your home or their agent should be contacted by your realtor to get feedback on your home and to gauge their interest. While your realtor does the heavy lifting when it comes to marketing, as a seller, you need to support your realtor in several ways. Keep your home as clean, neat, and odor-free as possible while your home is on the market. This may mean that you have to give up cooking your favorite dish and that you have to bribe your kids to make their beds and take out the trash every day. Make your home as available as possible to buyers, no matter how inconvenient it is for you and your family. Your home won't sell if no one can see it. Leave the house when buyers are there. Studies have shown that buyers look more carefully when the homeowners aren't present. Lock up your pets or take them away when buyers are visiting, especially during an open house when multiple visitors are expected. Provide information to buyers about community amenities or neighborhood sports leagues so they can appreciate your home's location. If you and your realtor develop a team approach to selling, you'll benefit from a quicker and more pleasant real estate transaction. If you're considering selling your home, I'd love the opportunity to show you my complete marketing program and discuss how we can work together to get your home sold quickly and for top dollar. Contact me today to get the conversation started. I will see you next week for a new seller themed video. Don't forget to like and share this video so I can help anyone you may know that may be looking to sell their home.